Greetings, grill tubers. Welcome to Coyote Jack's Book Pit. This is episode six. I am Coyote Jack. There's no time to cook. We've got some amazing news today. Chester? Chester? Hmm. Anyway, our illustrious sponsor, Char Griller Grills, is giving away a brand new flat iron griddle to you for free. They're just gonna ship it to you. Char Griller, man. It's a giveaway! This giveaway is very, very simple. There are three different ways to enter this giveaway. On Facebook, on Instagram, and on YouTube. You can actually enter on all three and increase your odds. Every single person that enters this giveaway, their names go into a digital bowl, and at the end of the week, we're gonna pick out one winner, and Char Griller sends you your brand new flat iron griddle. It's that simple. You can have up to three entries. If you're watching this on Instagram, all you have to do is pick, pick, like this video, Follow Coyote Jack Smoke Pit on Instagram. Follow Char Griller Grills on Instagram. And comment below, tag as many friends as you want. You can literally just tag like 50 friends, one friend, two friends. I tag more than one friend. If you're watching this on YouTube, all you have to do is like the video, subscribe to the Coyote Jack Smoke Pit YouTube channel, and comment below whatever you want on the video. I don't know, an emoji of a pumpkin, a fire, a bunny, all three, whatever you want. Comment below, and enters you to win. And if you're watching this on Facebook, like the video, follow the Coyote Jack Smoke Pit page on Facebook, and share this video everywhere. On your wall, on groups, to your friends, to your frenemies, to people you hate, to people you love. And the more times your name gets dropped into that digital bowl where you pick out the name and then you win, increases your chances. So get on Facebook, get on Instagram, and get on YouTube. This video is on all three, and share and tag and friend and all those things. All the instructions are also down in the description of this video. Grill tubers, this is exciting stuff. A flat iron griddle in the pit is gonna be amazing. You're gonna be able to cook whatever you want on it. Ch -ch 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 pancakes, ch -ch 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 eggs, ch -ch -ch little volcano onions. Chester, there you are. Man, you're missing all the stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't get your aprons in a bunch. I'll be right there. Char Griller Grills is gonna be sending us a flat iron griddle to us right now. And it should be dropping in any minute. Oh my God. Why? Oh God. Holy crap. It's here! 36 inch griddle, model E8936, heavy gauge steel, four burners, 60,000 total BTUs, folding cart construction, convenient tool storage, four zone cooking, one, two, three, four. Massive 775 square inches of total cook area. <gasps> 20 pound propane tank. Sold separately. Well, duh. You really need to get a P.O. box or something, man. They, they, these packages keep falling on my head. It's gonna create purple concrete damage. <laughs> oh, we have a P.O. box. Just get me out of here. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let me help you. Yeah, yeah, you, 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 you do your thing there. I'm gonna... I'm gonna go rest for a bit, just to All right, see you, you, you go next week. rest for a little bit. Uh, take a little break. Uh, I don't think the kid can take it anymore. If you guys wanna send anything to the show for unboxing, as a gift, products, anything you we, we want us to try out, uh, use the P.O. Box from now on, yeah? Just... Let's open this thing, put it together, and season it. Put it on the floor. 
flat part of the box. Yep. One of the bolts here to hold it in place. Don't tighten all the way. So while that part is holding this into place, get your other one ready. Put your elbows on these pads, grab this, and push. There. That's probably the hardest part. We can take these off. Still on the cardboard. Places here, two places here for the little racks that are going to hold the side. There's a screw here for the control panel. Loosen it up just a little bit. Don't take it off. Place this one in. Loosen it a little more for it to fit. It fits. And that's in. And that's it. There's a trick to telling if your propane tank is full or empty. If it's full, it's heavy, and it sounds like something's in it. If it's empty, it's, it's, it's really light. I like one of these. It's a little cheater. Sell it at Amazon, link below. And it's just the little middleman that tells you if it's full. Make sure it's tight. This goes right on there. This clamps right on. And that holds it into place. And you hook it up to the actual grill. Goes right over to green because it's full, ready to go. Lock it into place. This is where I'm gonna put this griddle because I can put these down, which is my favorite part is that I get to put these down. I don't have to, they're not permanent. I can put them down, I can put them up. It, it, it changes the game for me because I, like you see my, my space. I have a big space, but I'm still limited because I keep adding more stuff. You know how it is. All right here. And that's it. And now we're ready to put the griddle on. So there's little grooves, little holes right there on the edges. Where this actually fits. One, two, three, four. Four cooking zones. You can turn one down to low, one's medium, one's medium high, and one's high. Remember when you're cooking on charcoal, you have fire on one side, no fire on the other. Your cool zone, your hot zone. And here's everything we're going to be making on Coyote Jack Smoke Pit in the future. It's set up and it's in its location. This is where it's gonna be. This is where we're gonna be grilling. When uh, we have some breakfast or something, we can do that in the morning when the sun's not shining on our faces like this. But we need to season this thing first. This came from a factory. It's got machine oil. It's got shipping parts. It's got dust. It's got chemicals and we need to clean it. And the way you clean your grill is by seasoning it. You season everything. Any pots and pans, any skillets, any griddles, any... Um, Whatever you use, you always run it first once with a seasoning solution. First thing we need to do is we need to wash this griddle. This is the first and only and last time that you're going to be using soap and water on this griddle. After this, you will never ever wash this with soap and water. Because once we season this and food goes on, that's it. We want this to be nice and black and shiny, just the way your grandma used to have her skillets. The first thing we do is gonna wash it off because in the factory they add some vegetable oil on it to protect it and keep it from rust and making it safe for shipping.
wipe off. Just some water. Now to season it, we're gonna be using some vegetable shortening. You can use olive oil, you can use Pam spray, uh, you can brush it on, you can wipe it on. I like to use this because this is what I season my skillets with. So we're gonna treat it the same way. Turn on the gas. First light. Turn it on to high. Done. Turn it on to high. Done. Now I'm gonna actually put it to low, all of them, because I want it to be even heat and not too high, obviously. We're just letting it all settle. This is something you can do when you clean the grill. You can do a deep cleaning, spring cleaning, or a between season cleaning um, every few months or so. But you should always clean your grill, take care of it, oil it, uh, season it. The more you cook, the more you, it seasons, the better it is. Some little smoke starting to come out. I'm actually gonna add a little more. We turned it off. And now it's got a little bit of a yellow haze, some little brown spots here. There's a little bit of darkness around here. We're gonna kind of wipe this stuff off and clean that part off now. Just kind of making it even. I don't want it to pull up or anything. But that's basically it. We have seasoned our flat iron griddle. And that's it. That is how you open the box put it together, connect everything, and season it. That is how you take care of your flat iron griddle from Char Griller Grills. And remember, this is a giveaway. This is mine, and you can have your own. You can have your very own flat iron griddle from Char Griller Grills, they will send it to you. The contest starts now. You can do either Facebook or YouTube or Instagram, or you could do all three. I would do all three. The contest and the giveaway end on then we will take all of the names from all three entries, Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram, put them all in a digital bowl, pick a random name, and that name will be read out right here next week on episode seven. So lucky number seven, grill tubers. I'm gonna go look for some recipes now for my uh, griddle and uh, go check out uh, what's going on with Chester to see if he's okay. And I'll see you guys next week. This is Coyote Jack signing off.